Hi everybody, Weeby 108 Morning Man Jay Michaels. And guess what? It's time for another Tuesday test ride. This week, our featured dealer of the week is BMW of Bridgeport. And in just a moment, we're going to be test driving the all new 2015 435i X Drive hardtop convertible. It's got a lot of great features, it's going to be a lot of fun. We hope you'll go along with us for this test drive. And in just a moment, we've got Glenn here who's going to take us around the exterior of the automobile and we'll uh, hear a little bit about the, the features there and then we'll hop inside and enjoy the ride. So stick around with us. We're outside the dealership right now, BMW Bridgeport. A little humid out here. I've got Glenn. Yep. How you doing, Glenn? Well, Jay, great to see you again. Thanks it for coming back. terrific to see you again. Appreciate and, it. Uh, we're going to be taking a, a little trip in a, a quite a special car, the 435i. Yes. Uh, X Drive hardtop convertible, mm -hmm. which we are standing right next to. We are. And before we get in, why don't you take us a little trip around the outside of the car and, and, and tell us about it? Thanks, Jay. Uh, this is indeed the 435 X Drive convertible with BMW. And before we get in and take it out on the road, we're just going to show a couple of features of the car on the outside. And one of them is being able to open up the roof with the key fob as you approach the car. So as I hold the unlock button down on this key fob, I can actually start dropping the roof as I walk towards the vehicle. Now this is about a 20 second process to do this, and it's kind of nice because I can just jump in and start the car and be ready to drive. I don't have to wait on this. Uh, now you also can operate this from inside the car, but a really nice feature to be able to do this outside the car as well. And you see it's going to lock up here. Now, one other great little feature about this car is in the trunk. This has 13 cubic feet of trunk space. And I'm going to come to the back, and sometimes folks are concerned about being able to put some of their cargo or luggage in here as they're traveling because they just can't fit underneath the storage for the, for the roof itself. So right here, there's a button where I can just press and hold that, and this is going to lift the entire roof package and raise it up so I can come in here and lift my cover, stow my luggage down below, drop it down again, and then go ahead and just drop the rest of the housing and shut the trunk. So very, very convenient to be able to go ahead and store some of your cargo as you're driving. So we're going to go ahead and get inside the car and take it off, and we're going to talk about some of the driving features, some of the interior features. So let's roll. Here we go. Well, we're off on our Tuesday test drive, our featured dealer, BMW Bridgeport. Glenn is behind the wheel, and all of us already, I feel, the pickup on this 2015 yeah. 435i xDrive. Wow, this has got power, Glenn. Yeah, this is a, a 300 horsepower engine, 300 pounds of torque in this car, Jay. Uh, and we're only in the comfort boat now. I haven't even touched the driving dynamics and gone to sport yet, which we will do in a little bit. But it's, it's just a beautiful, powerful, wonderful handling automobile, obviously. And it is a, a hardtop convertible. And the surprising thing, Glenn, is how we can ride in this car, we have passengers, and, uh, you know, we're kind of still protected. I, I can hear you speak. You can hear me. Uh, there isn't a lot of noise. Yeah. Uh, and this is a... Tell us a little bit about uh, the evolution of this. This is kind of a new product for BMW, isn't it? Yeah, it is in the sense that BMW has never had an offering with a convertible that was an all-wheel drive vehicle. So now with the BMW X Drive, it's intelligent all-wheel drive all the time with a convertible. So this could be a year-round vehicle in New England. And the X Drive is just, you know, it's an extraordinary system in that it's infinitely variable. It can throw all the torque to a single wheel as need be. And it's always monitoring road conditions and shifting as, as needed. So it's, it's an amazing system, and it's just great to now have it available in the convertible. Glenn, you, know, you used a term before, driving dynamics. Yes. Let's talk about that a little bit. Okay, so BMW now has what they call a driving dynamics system where you can actually control some of the features and um, characteristics of the car under different road conditions as you're driving. So right now we're doing about, oh, a little under 70 miles an hour and I'm in the normal dry setting which is called comfort but at any point in time I can just change the settings by pressing one of these buttons and going up and down to sport or to comfort or to eco pro and changing you know the firmness of the suspension the steering the throttle response and the car will just pop so if I'm just driving here right now I can do this at any time at any speed I'm never restricted on when I can change it so I can just pop it and you just feel it 
Wow. Popping the torque. Is that sport that we just went into? That was sport From right there. To sport. Exactly. So the gear changes get a little tighter. Everything gets a little firmer and more responsive. Uh, so how about the gas mileage? Want to talk a little bit about that? Yeah, this, this vehicle right here has a combined uh, 28 uh, for fuel economy, uh, 34 on the highway, uh, 23 around town, I believe. Uh -huh. uh, but again, one of the great features of the driving dynamics is that I can go to the EcoPro setting right. and really maximize my efficiency, my fuel economy. And I would really recommend using this when you can turn on your cruise control. Right. So I'm going to go to sir, turn on my cruise and hit set. We're at 66 right now. Right. And I can, over a longer period of time, actually actually maximize my fuel efficiency. And I would get in the mid-30s to perhaps even the high 30s on a longer trip in this vehicle wow. with the EcoPro setting. All right, should we get into some of the, um, the te technology? We have the voice commands in terms of uh, how we want to operate our, our the radio station or any other functions. Yeah. Let's talk about that. Sure. So the voice commands, again, are a wonderful feature that contribute to the safe operation of the vehicle when you're driving. So to the extent that you can, you want to avoid reaching down to the controller because there's really no need to because most everything you can do here by hand, mm -hmm. you can do by voice very safely as you're driving. So anything I can do by hand, I can do by voice. So for example, if I want to set a new navigation destination, I can just press my voice button as I'm driving. Navigation. Navigation. Enter address. Please say the house number in single digits followed by the street the city and the state. 43 North Avenue, Bridgeport, Connecticut. Processing your input. Okay, it's pretty simple. Very simple. Uh, and it's going to look for it, it knows where we are. And now that I have guidance underway, I can just use the voice command to see how it intends to take me. So I'm mm -hmm. going to press my voice button. Route information. Route information. Yeah. Use the controller to proceed. Okay. So I can go ahead and take a look at the route it intends to take me. Oh, and I've got alternative routes if I don't want to go that way. One of the things I would like to mention about the voice commands is the fact that if you've got an iPhone now, right. there's full voice integration with the iPhone. So anything you can do with the iPhone out of the car, you can now do in the car without ever touching your phone. Siri, please send a text message. To whom shall I send that? Robin Howard. Okay, what do you want to say to Robin Howard? I'm out with Jay and the Weeby 108 team again, having a great time. See you tonight. Your message to Robin Howard says, I'm out with Jay and the Weeby 108 team again, having a great time. See you tonight. Ready to send it? Yes. Okay, I'll send it. There you go. This car has just about everything you need. I mean, uh, I'm very impressed. Yeah, the, the X-Drive in the convertible in BMW uh, is something we've been wanting for a long time. And the customers in the marketplace have really responded to it. Uh, we've delivered more uh, convertibles uh, in the last two years than I think we have in the last five years combined. So the X-Drive has really brought this car uh, into the forefront where it deserves to be and it's an amazing driving automobile. That begs the question, do you have many of these in stock right now at BMW Bridgeport? We do and they are ready to go. Well they are. Indeed. Yeah and it's you know the summer leasing specials are out so it's a great time to come and come into the store and test drive these cars and, and get a sense of what we've been talking about here on this trip and um, Everybody that test, just about everyone that test drives, it ends up taking one home. They're, they're just that good. If people want to see more before they come out, they can go to your website. Yes, indeed. Uh, BMW or Bridgeport.com. Okay. Uh, a lot of videos there that they can go watch a lot of what we've discussed as well. Yep. Um, so, yeah, have, it's, it's a great site. How about your hours? Do you have late hours? Do you stay open until, you know, at certain nights where well, people who go to work might want to come after work? Sure. I mean, Bridgeport's open until 7 o'clock Monday through Thursday, okay. uh, 6 o'clock on Friday, and 5 o'clock on Saturday. Fantastic. Um, and they open up at 9 o'clock every single day. Well, Glenn, we're very impressed. Uh, this is quite, this is the car of the future. It's the car of now, but yeah. really, BMW is ahead of the curve when it comes to the future of the automobiles and, and what an automobile can offer and how it performs. Uh, our feature deal of the week, BMW Bridgeport, and we, have, we are still in this wonderful car, the 435i X-Drive hardtop convertible all-wheel drive. Correct. I want to thank you very much for taking us out today. Thanks, Jay. We're so glad when you come by. We're glad to do it. Thanks uh, for coming. Terrific. All right, sir.